So how to interpret Thursday's vote on the great question of the day? Add the Brexit party vote to UKIP's, and of course many voters followed Nigel Farage from one party to the other, and that gives you just under 35% firmly in favour of Brexit. On the other side of the equation, add up the Lib Dems, Greens and Nationalists, plus the lacklustre change UK, and that gives you something over 40% remain. But Remainers should leave the champagne in the fridge, because when you add the Conservatives to that pro-Brexit column, that puts them back in the lead at around 44%. So Labour's position becomes critical here. If it remains true to its leader's philosophy, it carries the matter for Brexit. If it tilts towards a full-throated second referendum position, then it tips the balance the other way. Tory path seems clearer, drawn by Nigel Farage, closer to a no-deal Brexit position. But for Labour, this vote has already triggered a bitter internal battle.